am excited about the new Divergent movie, Allegiant. And mostly just because I love teen trilogies, or teen, uh, not necessarily going to be a trilogy. It could be a saga. Yeah. Um, and it doesn't even have to be teen. It could be categorized as teeny bopper. And I will still like it. Um, <laughs> more so. Yeah, yeah, more so. Put it on the Disney Channel, and I am in. Uh, yeah, so anyway, this is the, the final. They didn't split it into two movies. Thank you, Movie Studios. Um, it's the third in the Divergent series, and I'm just excited to kind of see how they close it out. I really enjoyed the third book. The second one was probably the weakest. Um, I liked the first one. I actually saw the movie first and then read the book, um, and then read the second book right before the second movie came out, and now the third book I read sometime last year. So um, I'm just excited to see the conclusion of this um, this uh, dystopian series. And Ooh. really, I'm kind of hoping this is the end of that dystopian thing, right? I, mean, I agree. And see, like, Pride and Prejudice and Zombies. Like, okay, let's all move on. Can we get back to, like, real-world storylines? Yeah. Like, let, let's, let's get a little more creative here, people. Please. Well, no, I, I will... Thank it, it, I'm not someone who has, I haven't read any of them diverge. I haven't actually seen any of them either, but when somebody explains it to me, I'm always like, oh, is that like the watered down version of the Jennifer Lawrence series? <laughs> because it yeah. just kind of feels like Hunger Games light. Um, but I'm in full support because those movies were all uh, Allegiant for sure. And the others were shot here in Atlanta. And um, I had my buddy worked on those and he just had all kinds of wonderful things to say about Shailene Woodley and Miles Teller and the entire cast and just about how fantastic they were to work with and what a fun shoot it was. And I just love that we can try and picture how they created dystopia out of, out of the Atlanta backdrop. So I'll definitely. Well, and it's interesting. It's interesting. It's interesting to know that because I didn't realize I thought they shot them in Chicago because it's based in Chicago. Um, the Hunger Games second, third, and fourth were shot in Atlanta as well, so yeah. that's amusing. That's apparently the the teeny bop capital now. What? Oh, poor O Town, poor O Town. It lost its title. It did. So anyway, uh, but that's good to hear because Shailene Woodley does seem like a good actress, a sweet girl. So it's good to hear that uh, she is what she appears to be. Absolutely. Um, I don't know when that comes out. Do you happen to know when that comes out? February? Something in 2016. February? A month that might end in Y? That's a few. Or R. Oh, a day of the week that ends in Y. I'm going to guess it opens on a Friday. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, nowadays they open on Wednesdays and Thursdays half the time. Well, definitely on a big holiday weekend they do that. Um, no, but we will find out by the time this thing gets posted and just... Make a little scrolling number right there. Um, it's going so to go right here. My 